Hi, my name is Terry McConker. I'm a final year student uh, studying information technology management for business. And my final year project was to develop um, a mobile information system for a nursing home. I called it Home Care Services Mobile Information Systems. The aim of this project was to develop um, a mobile information system capable of retrieving patient information um, from a central database. Um, it was it was a way of working uh, towards um, establishing a paperless office. Um, and the attempt, um, the other attempt in this project was to enable it to accurately get information from a database uh, in a timely and easy manner and reduce medical errors. Um, the mobile application itself is developed on Android at the moment um, and was developed using uh, Flash 4.5 uh, written with PHP, ActionScript uh, and XML um, or mobile XML. Um, the future of uh, such technologies in nursing homes are upcoming. Uh, it's something that has not yet been implemented uh, in the industry at the moment, but um, talks about such developments are, are talked about in the news of late. Um, the development that I came up with was that uh, where when you log in it actually brings the patient inf the patient list of um, that are being looked after by by the healthcare provider um, by clicking onto the name uh, you are able to go onto the patient uh, information which shows you the name uh, the age uh, basic uh, information about the patient in general um, the admission dates, uh, the background of the patient, and next of kin, who to contact next. On this home page, it allows you to take the profile picture of a patient, um, and this can be used um, as a profile image, and it's also updated onto the main database. Um, the app itself has three sections on top, which is uh, the resident, assessment, and care notes. In the assessment section, this allows you to take the daily information about the patient in regards to their health, uh, weight, blood pressure, pulse, the oxygen, uh, the temperature and uh, fluid balance, um, including appetite and the like. These can be easily logged in and by just pressing the button at the bottom there, it is updated in, in the database. You have another section where you can log in the patient's physical well-being. So if they have any injuries that are visible to the nursing staff, they can actually log that in. Um, within the nursing industry is a requirement that you have to take images of the patient's uh, wounds so that they can be easily assessed by medical professionals. Uh, this application allows you to actually take the image of the wounds uh, using the inbuilt camera on the device. Moving on to the care note, section. Uh, this allows you to log in notes about the patient's well-being. It also allows you to send this information to the database. Um, if any requirements, you have a section where you are allowed to send it via email. Uh, for health and security reasons, um, that section is normally locked to one email address, so you cannot send information to anybody else other than the pre-programmed email address. The future of such technology is that uh, you can use NFC technology as the mobile devices improve. Um, this will allow care staff to actually just place the device next to the patient's bedside and it will be able to retrieve the patient's information on, from a pre-programmed um, name tag of, of the patient. Um, other future developments will be to move uh, this application onto an iOS device or, web, or a web-based device. Uh, the advantages of such an application is that it reduces medical uh, costs um, in the sense that you can have few uh, professionals that are sat from an office and information sent from multiple devices can be analysed from one location um, in an office. Uh, the, the other improvement that can be done with such uh, an application is the use of error FIDs in the sense that you'll be able to track uh, the location of the actual patient. Um, this does throw up uh, privacy and security issues, 
but being in a nursing home and in support of in in support of the well-being of the patient it is necessary to be able to know the location of the patient and provide them freedom to actually move about within within the nursing home and be able to to be found if they need to do so thank you very much for for listening to my presentation